they estimated personal expenses here, but I want you to think through using the budget tool what other personal expenses she might have. And they also estimated transportation expenses, um, which I'm sure is based on having a SEPTA pass. Okay? So, first question, college charges per year. So what do we fill in for tuition and fees? 16658 Correct. 16658 For both? Yeah, so you can draw an arrow to, get, to connect the two. Wait, stay together. It's in-state costs, right? Yes. She lives in Right here, right? She lives in state. Yes. Yeah. Now remember we had that conversation about the difference between going to a state college in another state and going to one here? I just want to peek at the out of state cost real quick. So someone who doesn't live in Pennsylvania has to pay twenty eight thousand dollars a year for Temple. You guys have to pay sixteen thousand six hundred and fifty eight. So you save twelve thousand dollars a year over somebody outside of the state. Okay? Next. You notice how it says at the bottom, on-campus room and board. Yeah. Does she have to pay that? No. No, because she decided to do what? Stay at home. Stay at home, so slash through it. And what are the total charges that are paid to the college then? 16658 That's what she owes this year. Just one year. Was that year? says, oh my goodness. We're going to talk about that in a second. <laughs> We got this. She is, well, the one thing that might make you guys feel a little bit better is when you see where the money comes from. Okay. Additional expenses. How much are books and supplies? What did I tell you her books and supplies cost? $942. $942. Great. So let's write that in. That's okay. I have to go with what it says in the case study because even though College Board has its opinions, everybody's total is different. Wouldn't it be plus the 200 though? Oh, good point. Good point. Right. Plus 200 for the lab fees. Thank you for catching that. It's 1142 Now, how much is she paying in rent? Nothing. Zero. Nothing. Lucky dog. She's living with mom. How much is she paying for utilities? Nothing. Nothing. She's living with mom. Yes. Take advantage of that as long as you can. Okay. So I want you guys to guess to me. These things you guys know. How much does a cell phone bill cost? Okay. So, so would you say that a telephone bill is something that is discretionary, meaning you could spend a ton of money on your phone, or you could spend a way lot less if your budget doesn't really have the money for it? Yeah. All right. Do you guys want to start figuring that out now, or do you want to figure that out after we figure out how much money is coming from the government? How do you think is the better way to budget? Do you just want to decide what you want now and make your money fit it? Or do you want to figure out how much money you have and see if you can get your bills to fit it? Later. Okay.